Hello again, my sparries. It's Keisha, and I'm here with another video for you guys. It might not be for everyone. It may only be for people that are living in Canada or Ontario or in the GTA that are looking to eat. They're looking for rentals. They're looking to invest and they're looking to purchase. So I am selling Mount Forest. So today <laughs> my topic will be selling Mount Forest, Ontario. I live in Mount Forest, Ontario, and I've been living here for about almost four years. There's not a lot of minorities, which is myself black people there are not a lot of blacks there are not a lot of indians there are not a lot of chinese so i decide why not sell mount forest the rent here in mount forest are very cheap or not it is cheaper than the big city such as toronto brampton scarborough and all those areas and the properties are even cheaper than all of those cities also and they are building up some new homes right now, new condos and detached. And for the investors, you can invest, you know that. You can invest in this city. There's lots of um, warehouse that they have here. So there are people that coming in from the city to work in the, the, um, the warehouses and are relocating, relocating because of the winter storms because during the winter it's uh, it's very hard driving back and forth to the city so a lot of people just um they're looking for places that they can live so because they have a job and these jobs usually keep you for uh, quite a while so there's lots as i said lots of warehouse job there's um jobs such such as cashier jobs at no frills canadian tire and those retail places so you can get those kind of jobs there's a lot of construction job that goes on around here in the town or nearby towns so i would encourage you if you are an investor especially indian investor black investor and chinese investor to invest in the city we need more minorities we need the city to be more um diverse so i am actually <laughs> challenging myself to get more people to move in this area and i will show you guys a little bit about my i'll show you guys a little my my yard space that i have so comparing to the city you have huge yard space you have half an acre to almost two acres of land that you may get some houses i've seen posted for um with five acres of land and they're huge homes where you can honestly invest you can invest by either renting rooms or renting the old property itself because there are people that are looking for a property there's a lot of locals they do not own they're looking for rentals and we're short rental properties and we're also looking for nurses and doctors because we knew we need nurses in the hospitals the nurses the hospital has been closing early because we don't have enough staff so we're looking for nurses also and if we can get these nurses in our our town we're able to we'll be able to um get rental properties for them because there are properties here plus we'll, we'll we'll love to have more investor investing in the properties so that i can rent it out for you guys because you know i'm a property manager so you know i will be able to manage these property for you guys locally so yes we're looking for investors we're looking for real estate brokers we're looking for we're looking for mortgage brokers who are investors and want to invest in properties tons of properties in Wellington North that are selling and we need you guys especially again especially the blacks the Indians and the Chinese we need to have a diverse community in wellington north and if you are black chinese and indian nurses we need to have you guys here and doctors we need to have you guys here again 
the hospitals are closing early because we do not have enough staff. I know in the city there are so many other jobs. They may not have a lot of staff themselves, but we need you here. We need you here, okay? So I hope this reaches more of the local investors in Toronto. And yes, check it out. Check out Mount Forest. A lot of people never heard of it before. It is it is just an hour and a half north of Toronto and Brampton. So it doesn't take that long to drive. And anyone that works from home, this, is, this will work perfectly for you guys. The rent is not bad. A two bedroom, one bedroom, maybe going for about $1,300 and a two bedroom may go for like 15 ish 14 1500 dollars a three bedroom you'll find for 2100 dollars and four bedroom will go for 28 which is cheaper because i know in brampton um one bedroom is going for like 1800 dollars two bedroom is going for 2200 dollars and like a uh, three bedroom is going for 35 and four bedroom is between 35 and four thousand dollars so if you want to save a couple bucks come to mount forest black indian and chinese we need a diverse population here so hope you guys have a great day a great week and a great month